All right, so for this recipe, I have put together um, or mixed up a, a pudding filling mix, uh, which is basically pudding, whipping cream, a little bit of milk, and you blend it really good like you would just your pudding. That's gonna be inside these little treats. Uh, I've got some dark chocolate frosting. And these are yummy, like um, mint chocolate wafer cookies, little cookies. And what I did is I blended them in my KitchenAid to grind them up really good because we want it to look like dirt. This is a cake, <laughs> a chocolate cake, a dark chocolate cake that I actually made in my Instapot, believe it or not, or my pressure cooker, and I'll show you what that looks like. It's so easy to make a cake. In fact, I made two, see? Um, basically, all you do is mix up your cake mix, and then I use this little bun cake container, and my little, uh, I don't know what they call this thing, but you basically mix it up, put this right on into the Instapot. And my new Instapot actually has a setting for cake. I just basically mix it up, put it in here, put a little water in the bottom of the Instapot, and I hit the button, which is cake, and it's like 40, 40 minutes, uh, give or take, because it's got to pressurize. And out comes this beautiful cake. They are so moist. I've probably made about six cakes in this thing already, and I've only had this thing about, would I get this three months ago, two months ago? Uh, so be careful, it's dangerous. Don't eat all the cake. I'm gonna make it kind of like my um, uh, truffle cakes, or trifle, trifle cakes. So I'm just gonna cut into this and put a layer of the cake on the bottom. Push it down a little. And then, oops, I'm gonna take that yummy pudding, put the pudding in there, be real careful not to crack the clay, that would be gross. And then you put the pudding, like so. And then, I'm gonna cut a little more cake to go on top. Cake on top. And then I'm gonna put the chocolate frosting. I love these because it's okay if you're messy because it's a dirt, it's a dirt cake anyways. And then I'm gonna take the cookie. Take a pinch of that because I've learned this before. I tried pouring it and I pour too much. But then you just sprinkle. Look at that, the cookie on top, and it looks like dirt, doesn't it? And then, you could take and put sprinkles on it too, but then you put your little worm on top. And there it is, how cute. So simple, fun for birthday parties.